Thank you, Convener. Good morning, Minister. Uh, did the Scottish Government take formal legal advice prior to taking the decision to pause the scheme on the impact of that decision? Uh, The uh, Scottish Government, of course, takes many, many types of advice and has received legal matter of advice on matters relating to DRS on an ongoing basis as appropriate. Uh, the member will appreciate that this, in the last two weeks, has happened very, very quickly uh, in terms of a very short time scale from when that letter was received and reaffirmed on June 5th to when I made the announcement to Parliament. But within that time, I did meet, and the First Minister and myself did we meet with businesses to understand how they felt we should react to this That's uh, not to what I asked, Minister. <coughs> Can we take it then that no legal advice was specifically sought prior to pausing the scheme on the impact of that pause? Uh, the content of legal advice is confidential. And I know. By long Did you standing take legal advice, Minister? Uh, yes or no? Scottish and uh, uh, that, as far as I know, that is a matter on which I am not able to discuss. But uh, uh, so may be able to provide more detail there. Yeah. Um, I, so, as the Minister has said, um, the Scottish Government has received legal advice on uh, matters to, relating to DRS on an ongoing basis. But specifically I, on the decision to pause the scheme? It's so a yes or no question. The Scottish with Government's respect. position on any matter <clears throat> is, and its decision making is consistent with legal advice uh, that it receives. The First Minister said on Sunday, Minister, that no compensation would be due to, uh, from the Scottish Government to businesses who are out of pocket due to the aborted scheme. The Minister will appreciate that there's always litigation risk. Uh, so how much of a contingency has the Scottish Government budgeted uh, in case the position is not as set out by the First Minister? And in which budget line is that contingency made? That the member will appreciate that we are working with industry to launch the scheme and that the matter of that sort of compensation is not something that was part of the, the Scottish budget. But a responsible government would surely make a contingency in case their position is not as they think it is. Yes? Do any of the officials have any comment on that? I, I'd like the Minister's response, please, as, as representative of the Scottish Government. The position of the Scottish Government is that while we recognise the steps that businesses have taken to get ready for DRS, uh, min we ministers were required in the last few weeks to respond significantly to challenges imposed upon us by the UK Government, and we do not consider that any action we have been required to take gives rise to any obligation to pay compensation. And so no contingency has been made, or, Minister, do you not know if a contingency has been made? We don't believe that any action that we have been required to take gives rise to any obligation to pay compensation. Indeed. 